Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to show you how to create a black and white effect for all of your photos and videos by using the free software CapCut. I will be editing today by using CapCut on my PC, so follow along. Okay, so with CapCut on my PC open, I'm going to click Create Project. I'm going to import a few images. I'm going to import these five images and add them all to my track by clicking this plus sign. That adds all of my five images down to my project down here, you can see. And now what I want to do is apply a black and white effect to all of my images. So the first thing I want to do is just make sure my images look okay and that they are the right size. Um, you can see these are a little bit small and then there's a black background. So what I want to do is adjust each of these so they're a little bit bigger. So what I can do is just drag and drop the corners to make each of my images a little bit bigger so there's no black background. Okay, now once that's done, I want to apply a black and white effect to all of my images. This would also apply to videos too, so let me just go ahead and import a video as well. Okay, I'm going to import this video into my track. And then I'm just going to trim it down a bit so it doesn't take that long. Now I have five photos and one video. So there's a way to apply a black and white filter to all of these images and you're going to do that by using color grading. So I'm going to click on the first image here and on the right hand panel click on adjustment. From here I'm going to want to change this to completely black and white and how you want to do that is to adjust the saturation. So down here on the saturation bar, drag it all the way to the left. And there you see all of the colors in my photos disappeared. With saturation being set, I also want to increase the contrast to make the black stand out a little bit more against my black and white. So I'm gonna update the contrast by dragging it to the right. And however you feel this looks the best. You can change the shadows, the lighting, the exposure. You just want to make sure that the black and white stand out very clearly. So however you want yours to look, you can adjust them right here. And once you have your desired look, what you want to do, one more thing here, sharpen it a little bit. Okay, what you want to do here is apply to all, and that's going to apply to all of your five photos as well as your video. So let's see how it works. Applied to all clips. So now let's see the next video, black and white. Next one is black and white. And even my video here is black and white. Now, say I wanted to bring back in this video with color. I'm going to bring this colorful video back into my track drag it to the end and then I'm going to shorten it again. So this one you can see is still full color. I want to show you how to save my black and white preset as a preset so I can apply it later on or to another project. So with my old clip highlighted that was black and white, I'm going to click save as preset. Adjustments preset save to CapCut Ninja which is my space. So that's my brand space. If I go to adjustments here on the top, you can see a section here called presets and that is what we just defined. So I'm gonna click presets and this one right here on the left hand side is what we just saved as our preset. I'm going to right click it and rename it so I can remember what it is later. Black and white. I'm gonna save that name. 
Okay, now the cool thing that I can do here is use this preset anytime I want to apply my black and white effect in any project. So I'm going to click on my colorful video here and I'm going to add it to my track. It's gonna drop it to wherever my white line was here. So since it was all the way to the left, it popped in here, but I wanna apply it over on my colorful clip. So I'm gonna make it a little bit shorter. And now wherever I drop this preset, it's going to change the video or the picture that's directly underneath. So watch how this works. See how it turned it black and white just for that tiny segment of your video? You could even do a really cool effect by making this short, copying it, pasting it by doing Control C and Control V, those are the shortcuts. And now you can kind of drag these around. Let me zoom in a little. And you can make a cool little effect here by going in and out of black and white in my video. Let's see how this looks. Add one more by doing Control V. Now you'll see it flicker back and forth between color and black and white. Kind of a fun effect you can use here. So this is just a tutorial how to do black and white, but as you can imagine, the opportunity here is endless and you can choose any type of preset uh, with your colors and you can apply it easily throughout your entire project. You can do it for this project and you can save it in your brand kit for another project in the future. I hope this helped you. If you found this video valuable and helpful, please like and subscribe.